Hi guys, welcome to this edition of Todo Fine, the Teen Magazine of Fine Tune English. I'm Nicolas and today I will be your host of this video dedicated especially for you. In this video, my group will share uh, tips and content for improving your English. To add to that, we will show a funny sketch about types of relationships in a classroom, the cultural segments, It will be five things you didn't know about Matilde Hidalgo. Finally, in the entertainment segment, we will talk about the Met Gala. Let's get started. Hello everybody, my name is Jorge. For today, we have prepared a section with curiosities of the language in order to practice some grammar. So, get ready. Do you know the correct meaning of the word actually? If you are thinking that actually means nowadays, let me say you are wrong. It is used to emphasize that something is true. Actually means in fact or real. Listen to these examples. Which one is correct? Actually, the word is produced. Hey Jorge, you Hi. are studying medicine, aren't you? No, I'm not. Actually, I am studying architecture. I hope that's clear for you. Talk to you soon. In a wave full of English learning offers, One Man's Academy, Fast Learning Programs, and Garage Institutes, comes the worst of all. The Gringo Feliz Center, where learning English is not an option. It is difficult to be a student without seeing some types of relationships in your class. So, here we can see the first type of relationship. Number one, the Siamese couple. This pair is the most regular pair that we could see around us. They cannot be two seconds apart. Number two, the ninja. This is a very difficult type to identify. This pair hides their love to avoid people who gossip or because they like discretion. Ransom boy. This specimen is a common in our ecosystem. When you are in the friend zone, girls can use you as a slave. So, Emima, when are you going to be my girl? Number 4. Virtual Girlfriend. An average boy every day takes his computer into the class talking with it, just like if he were crazy. I want you here with me all the time. You are the best. Number 5. Classic Lover. I wrote this for you. Roses are red, violets are blue, you're so beautiful and I wanna be with you. <laughs> this guy tries hard to make his girl fall in love with him. Welcome to the second English segment. Do you know the difference between there, there, and there? Let me explain them to you. There is the contraction from they are. They are practicing for the basketball championship. There means in or at that place. Stay over there. There is the positive pronoun of they. This is their house. We can mix all of them in a sentence like this. They are at their classroom, stay over there. That's it for there, there and there. Hi everyone, my name is Giovanna and I am going to tell you Five things you didn't know about Matilde Hidalgo. Number one, she was born in Loja to a family of six children. 
Byrne y Juan Manuel Hidalgo en Carmen Navarro. Antes de dejar el diet, her mother had to work as a seamstress to take care of them. Matilde studied at the elementary school, La Inmaculada. Number 2. She was the first Lohana woman to go to high school. After graduating from this grade, she applied and was accepted into the high school Bernardo Valdivieso. Even though relations in the community was not very good, her mother fully supported her. Number 3. Not only did she graduate, she also was the first woman to receive a degree. That degree was a doctorate in medicine. Number 4. Matilde had it all. She also married. After getting her degree, she married the lawyer Fernando Procel and they had two children named Fernando and Gonzalo Procel. Fernando was a doctor while Gonzalo was an architect. Number 5. Last but not least, Matilde was the first woman to vote in an election in Latin America and the first to hold elect office. And she set the president for women in politics and her victories keep adding up. Those are five things you probably didn't know about Matilde Hidalgo. Thank you for watching. For the last English segment, we will be exploring your and your. Your and your are two words like a sound like the same, but they have differences between them. Your is the possessive pronoun of you. Here is your book, which is your cup. Your is a contraction from you are. You are an amazing person. You are in a trouble for that. If we mix both in a sentence, the result will be. You are the best score. You are the highest score. This is all about the English language. Remember, keep practicing to improve your level. Goodbye. Hey everyone, I am Gemima and she's Ana Camila. And today we are going to talk about the Met Gala. The Met Gala is an annual event for the benefit of the Metropolitan Museum of Arts Costume Institute in New York City. It takes place every first Monday of May. There are 500 people who are invited and guests that pay 250,000 per table. This money is given to the Costumes Institute. We know that in the Met Gala people wear extravagant costumes, but why? Every year there's a theme. This year was camp, inspired by an essay that was published by the philosopher Susan Sotang, which talks about extravagance and supernaturality. That was an advantage for the guests, so that they could be as bold as they want. There were some gowns which were highlighted in the middle of the crowd. Many costumes stood out due to the peculiar designs. This year Lady Gaga, who is known for her extravagant costumes, captured the attention of the audience with her four outfits in one. In the same way, Ezra Miller, with his awesome makeup, left more than one person with their mouth open. He surprised people with seven super realistic eyes painted on his face. However, in my opinion, one of the best suits was Zendaya's dress. She wore a magical gray dress inspired by Cinderella, which was designed by Lou Roche, who accompanied Zendaya as her fairy godmother. By wearing the magic wand, the dress came alive, providing a great show at the gala. Thank, Thank you. you. This is all for today. We hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, press like and activate the bell. Remember, follow all Fine Tune English social media, comment on this video. We will be expecting you. Until then, be totally fine. Bye.